Grant here from Briggs & Stratton. Just want to walk you through the startup processes on our P3000 and P2200 inverter generators, which are the same. On this side, you'll actually see we've got our integrated on-off switch, which is also a fuel tap. We've got our recoil starter here and our choke control. Before you start the machine up, just make sure that you ventilate the tank and make sure that you turn the switch to the on position. Also, the QPT or PowerSmart switch needs to be in the off position when you do this. Our choke goes on and I'll now start the machine. I've now turned the power smart switch on so you can hear the machine drop down. Turn the machine off, simple matter of turning the on off switch. Also, when you're ready to connect up to the machine with your 240 volt lead, just make sure that the lead's not looking like this. We like to keep our leads look, looking neat and tidy, but the worst thing you can actually do is roll a lead up like this. Make sure there's no tangles, make sure it's smooth and flat and not coiled up like this. One thing you also notice about it, if you're using a 15 amp, is that you've got the larger earth tang here. Suitable to go straight in the front of this machine, we've got the larger receptacle to take the 15 amp lead. That's a startup procedure on the P3000 and the P2200.